Good morning, my dear students. Myself Priya, physical science teacher of Kakatiya Public School. Today, I am going to explain about this topic that is matter around. What is matter? What do you mean by the term matter? In previous classes, you have studied about acids and bases, synthetic and natural materials, and metals and non metals. These all are examples of matter. In our daily life, air we breathe, water we drink, food we take, clothes we use. These are the general examples of matter. So, what is matter? What do you mean by the term? matter. Anything in this world occupies some space, occupies space and has considerable mass. And has considerable mass. What is matter made up of? Children, this is very interesting question. What is matter made up of? Matter made up of tiny particles. Matter can exist in three states that is solid, liquid and gas. Again we can say that states of matter. We have three states of matter that is solid, liquid and gas. We have three different types. We have three states of matter that is solid state, liquid state and gas state. So if any object we are, if we are choosing any object, example this is one marker, whether it is solid, liquid or gas, how we will, how you will differentiate whether it is solid, liquid or gas. Depends on material. So, solid have fixed shape and fixed volume. Liquid have no shape and fixed volume. Gas neither fixed shape nor fixed volume. So now let us discuss brief about this topic. How we will recognize whether any object, whether it is a solid, liquid or Yes. Now let us discuss more brief, more briefly about this topic that is properties of states of matter. Properties of states of matter. Now we are taking one example that is water. Whether water is liquid, solid or gas. Water can exist three states. Water can exist three states, solid, liquid and gas. Water can exist three states, solid, liquid, gas. When you are, when you are taking some water, you will keep in a refrigerator, it will become ice that is in crystal form. When you are take the ice pieces and keep aside, after some time if you see that is in liquid form. When you take that water and you apply some heat that is water vapor. So 
Now, properties of states of matter. Properties of states of matter. Properties of states of matter. Solid. Arrangement of molecules in solids. There is no space between molecules. There is no space between molecules. Molecules of solids are tightly packed with no intermolecular spaces. There is no there is there is a force of attraction. very high force of attraction is very high comparing two liquids liquids have some space between the molecules force of attraction is less now we are discussing about gases you can see the molecules in gases are moving random directions so force of attraction is in negligible Force of attraction in about compressibility with an example. This is syringe. All of you know. Used for injections. So, this is we call nozzle. This is piston. So, now with one finger I am closing this nozzle with one end and I am I'm applying some force to move the piston forward. Whether it will move? Yes, it will move. In this empty tube, what we will observe? Air. So, compressibility is high, highly possible in gases. Highly possible in gases. Now I am filling this syringe in with water. But I am trying to, I am closing one end, I am closing the nostril with one finger and I am trying to push this forward. Inside, inside the tube we have water. Whether it will move? Yes, it will move. But comparing to previous case, we have to apply some more force to move. So, in liquids, compressibility is less. Less compressibility. So, I'm remove, I'm, I have to remove this, uh, I'm removing this piston and inside the tube, I'm adjusting one wooden box which is solid and I am closing this with my finger nostril I am closing this with my finger now inside the tube we have one wooden box now I am trying to move for I am trying to this I am trying to move forward this piston whether it will move no it cannot move because inside we have wooden box so there is no compressibility in Solids. Diffusion of gases. Diffusion of gases. Ask 
ask your friend to take one incense stick and with that with that incense stick you have tell him to stand in one one corner of the room you stand in another corner of the room what you will observe after after some time you take one uh, you light a, you light the incense stick and after after a few second you observe some vapor some vapors of smell will come outside and you can sense it so by this by this example what you will recognize that diffusion of gases are highly in gas state and less in liquid state we cannot we cannot say diffusion in diffusion they do not participate in solids